Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel, Honey Fans Now. Today I will be showing you guys how to do rose quartz nails. It's very popular, it's very nice, and of course I will be showing it to you guys today. So first of all, um, so I don't have a hand model, so it's just a, a fake silicone fingers um, that I will be demoing. and. Um, so, so this is the nail that you would uh, do for your client. So uh, let's see, uh, let's say this is a crystal clear nail, um, acrylic nail. This is the finish, right? I, I know it's a, this is just a tip that I put on, but if you were to do it for your client, that would be uh, a finished nail or acrylic, uh, crystal clear. All right, so I want you to to pick a, a neon pink um, because you don't want it to use too much uh, paint out of this pink. So um, Honey's Nail Secret has uh, this perfect neon. It's neon 57. So I will just do a very uh, light, not even a drop, okay? It's just, just like a, a tiny bit of, um, let me put this down so I can get other stuff. Okay, so it's just a little single, um, just a touch up of a pink and then next up I am going to use the gloss top coat for the gloss top coat I will be putting about two drops in okay so two drops of gloss top coat uh, you are trying to do this because you want it to uh, have this little sheer pink look for the quartz nails so let's just mix that up a little bit Yes, let's mix it up and it will become something like this. Okay. So if you think it's a little too less, I will add a little bit more. So I think it's I think it dropped too much top coat in there. Okay. So until you see this sheer pink look. Okay, like that. Alright. Okay. So that's done for the mixing part and pull out my lamp. Okay, so I want you to use this brush um, or you can use any type of brush that has a head like this. This is called a flat brush. And what you want it to do is brush that on. You see that little sheer looking pink? Okay, so I'm trying to not get it into the nail but if it does it's okay this fake finger is so hard to work with this would be so much easier if i were to do it on a real client's hand but it's okay because i don't have nobody here today so i decided to make a video of this Alright, so you get that sheer pink look. That's what you want it to achieve. Okay, and uh, I want you to put this into the lamp, the, L, uh, the UV LED light, uh, and cure it for approximately about a minute, just like how you would cure other nail polishes. So it's about the same. Put it into the light. And let's wait one minute. So, if you have jelly colors, um, uh, you can use that. I think it only looks good in the pink. I'm not sure. In any other colors, it would look good. I haven't done um, anything that looked as good as pink. And then next up, I want you to prepare ink, okay? So this is marble ink. This is not gel, it's not regular, it's ink. So it's a different type. It's, it's not even a polish. I wouldn't call that a polish. All right. And, okay, let's pull that out. There we go. And now I will be putting a mat 
top coat on it. So this is matte top coat. I will put a layer of matte top coat. Okay. And then we're going to cure that one more time. Okay, that away. okay, I want you to prepare this as acetone, 100% pure acetone. Okay. And then ink. This is going to look really nice. It turns out very nice. Okay, there we go. This ink. I'm going to wash my brush off while waiting for that one to dry. And I want you to shake up your ink because um, if you let it sit for too long, all the pigments are, are sinking down at the bottom of the bottle. So I want you to shake up your ink before you try to do anything so there we go now you see there is a sheer coat of pink right all right i want you to open this one very careful the ink oh, it's very easy to spill so we are going from left to right left to right and i will make two two lines okay so I'll go left to right, and I'm gonna color that in one more time. Okay, now you see all this veins, all this outline. So I want you to use your brush and clean the inner line. Okay, it's gonna clean it like that. It's clean. It's like um, freestyle and it's up to you. So you can do uh, lines going up and down, going across. You can take this out, you can push it in. It's really up to you and your design. It's your, the rose quartz is, um, there's not a rule to it. But there's gonna be um, white lines going across up the nail. Okay, I don't know why this sticks up so bad. All right, so once it's done, once you're done cleaning, I want you to put another layer of matte top coat. So this matte is protecting the first layer of the ink. All right, so this is what you see. It's protecting the first layer of the ink. All right, let's put that in there again. I want you to cure again uh, for approximately about 60 seconds. It's the um, good curing time for gel polish. Yes, and then you will, let me shake up this ink one more time. Just let to shake it up so that the pigment is very well um, pigmented and it's not loose or it's not thick, right? Now you see it. And then now we are going to do it the opposite way. So we went from left to right. Now we are going from right to left. Okay. Okay. Now you guys see it's coming up. It's, it's done very easy. It's like uh, probably it takes about two or three minutes per nail. Not with the curing time, because the, the curing is about a minute every time, but just the design itself. All right. Okay. And I will make this line. This is acetone, so you just keep tapping your brush, the same brush. Just keep tapping your brush and clean that out. And I'm going to add in another layer another layer just to make it show up a little bit more okay you can add as many layers as you want okay i want that my white line you see that one to be to show up a little well more um, visible so okay and then i'm gonna do that one one more time, and then as soon as you're done, you can actually gloss it off with matte. Uh, I'm sorry, uh, gloss top coat. Okay, so this is gloss top coat. So I'm gonna gloss.
gloss it with the gloss tuck. It dries very fast, guys. This is the um, ink, so it dries pretty quick. Don't mind the nail sticking up, guys. Okay. So that's that. Alright, hope you enjoy it. And I will see you guys in my next video. Subscribe my channel for more detailed videos on how to do designs, acrylic applications, and much, much more. Thank you so much for watching. Of course, now you cure this six seconds and you're done thank you and good luck